really appreciate y'all letting me tag along today, especially considering how everything ended the other day. Unfortunately, you and Jude are married now, so now you're fully engulfed in the The kids don't want you to go nowhere. Hell, I don't want you to go nowhere. I mean, I enjoy you being around. I've been trying to get June to understand too, like, you know, it's not just her anymore. I love y'all, I love them kids, but it puts me in a hard position because sometimes just like how she, in the house, she was like, well, Justin knew about it, knowing that was a lie and knowing that if I was told that I was gonna go in there and call her out on it, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, but she did it anyways. But she did it anyway. Because sometimes in her mind, I feel like she does it thinking that I'm just supposed to defend her because she's my wife. Because right. if I don't and I go back to living the other way, the effect, the outcome is not too good. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I have to live every part of my life a certain way. That's why I do it. I'm coming up on three years of sobriety. And a big part of that sobriety is being honest with myself and others. And out of all people, June should understand that. She's got a longer sobriety time than me. And she's putting all, all of that at jeopardy by just constantly lying and doing the dumb Wide open is the only way. Whether she used the money to help the kids, bro, or whatever form she used it. I guess in the end, in Alana's eyes, she's like, I don't want to ruin it all. She didn't want to ruin the fact that June was back in her life, so on and so forth, with all the other that's come along with it. Yeah. That was her biggest thing. And she's like, I know if I ask this question that it's gonna f something up. And it did. Even June, not saying that she's not trying, but she's still slacking a little bit because that's one of them things that you knew was gonna eventually come up. So you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so like why not you try should have covered to last that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When everybody was in therapy and like that. If you were gonna go to therapy and you were gonna put in the 110% like she has been putting in to be there for the kids, then that's one of those things that should have been nipped in the bud in the beginning. Yeah. She won't open her mouth, bro, until it's like off the edge. She opens her mouth about the dumb that doesn't matter. The kids already know, just like you, that if she starts spurting out random she's trying to cover her ass on something, yeah. then it's like she gets caught up in the lies. Yeah, then the kids get thing. pissed off. Yeah, we can all sit down like the dogs and have, yeah, it doesn't have to be an argument.